Hello guys and welcome to my first bit of my October haul and wow do we have a lot of it. I don't really know what's going on here. I don't know what of this is orders, what is what, what's going on. I just know that I have this is all this. I know that this was one order and I have a huge fantasy wax order. Let's go into this that I like know what it is. So basically usually I do Christmas all of December in both of my planners. Whatever, fine, easy. However, I'm just extra excited for Christmas this year. So I know, and usually I will like try to do most of November also Christmas, but I usually don't have enough kits because I use two planners. But I decided this year, you know what, fuck that. I'm just gonna order a bunch of old kits and reuse them with like different foil combos, so on and so forth. So I picked up this stack. First thing I picked up was the Cheers Bundle which I got to use for New Year's week because I want to do navy solid underlays, I think, in my filming planner with pixie gold um, fireworks over it. I think that would be really pretty. I picked up, I'm not going to open these because these are old kits. I have a whole video on like old SPC New Year's kits and Christmas kits in perfect pair videos. I got Miss Merry Mistletoe. We got Christmas Countdown. Wonderful. Holiday, Holly Jolly, I can't read, um, Sleigh Bells, Holiday Prep, Christmas, Bright Christmas, Chris, I don't know how to say that, and Merry and Bright, and yeah, so that's that, and now we will just jump in, I believe, to this. Okay, and then I don't really know if this was all one order or what the tea is with this. We're just going to go through everything I have, okay? We do have the tinsel kit, which is, is new art. I really just don't feel like opening these right now, but here's that one. This is one of the pop mysteries, and it's called Whoville, and it's Grinch themed. We got Christmas Countdown. This one's super pretty. I love this one, Carol. My family, not my family, my mom, my sister, me, and my aunt used to go to this thing every single year. It was called a Dickens Christmas in this town called Skinny Atlas in like upstate New York. They like characters from a Christmas Carol walking around and stuff. So that's just like the vibes this gives me. It just makes me think of my fam bam. Then we do have the November mystery here, which I will take out because I haven't even seen this yet. It is so pretty. It's like this pink girls night celebratory fun pretty kit. A little charcuterie board, the donut tray. Like this like little faux glitter in there is really pretty. The cheersing, the extra color. She is so cute. Her outfit. She got a little butt chin. If you know anything about me, you know I love a butt chin. And this did come with a champagne lights foil bundle. Very pretty. Obsessed. Love her. I don't know what this could be. Like, there's a strawberry bundle in here. Did I order this? Is this mine? So cute, we've got a little journaling card here. Oh, okay. It was, I think, I think this is the, a freebie? Yeah, $150 freebie is this strawberry bundle. I'm looking at it like, what the fuck could this be? Okay, all the free brewers. Okay, this is the rest of that order, but with all of the other, at, with all the freebies and the small sheets. Okay, we've got this in matte bronze. We've got some Halloween silver, some Halloween script. I think I could zoom in a little bit more. Some more Halloween overlays, and this is so cute. I'm obsessed with this freebie with all the different characters on it. Love, love, love. Okay, I don't have add-ons for all those kits that I need to like put in. And then we do have all of the color of the week in this beautiful blue color. Now let's pull these kits back out so I can put what goes with them. For tinsel, I did pick up Fam 6 and the Doodles. She is so pretty. I won't use the boy because I don't got me a blondie boy. Then we have the Whoville Doodles. 
Oh my god, I didn't notice this. Little Grinch, tell me why Baby Grinch and Little Grinch isn't the cutest shit ever. Obsessed. Christmas countdown. I got the girls and the doodles. Obviously there's no add-ons for the mystery kit because that would be weird. And then for Carol, I got this. Oh yeah, I got the tall girl. She is so fabulous. Love her. And then we got the color of the week scribblers. This is very distracting. And then I got Dr. Facilier, Gaston, and Ursula. So cute. Keep all of the doodles in its own little pile. Keeping my freebies in a pile. Keeping all my piles in piles and piles, okay? And I think this is probably what went with my massive stack of kits as like the freebie situation. Obsessed with this. Love this journaling card. This is so cute. Love. Ooh, these are really pretty like autumnal overlays. As well as this like little cute Thanksgiving overlay. And then I got this cross cross um bundle as well as another one of all the little all oh, these are different characters this is october it's all the spooky people we love to see it okay and so i think this is the last actual order of stickers i have here Again, all of those freebies and the journaling card. This one's so pretty. Love it. Love it. Ooh. This color of the week is like, like the color is not like a color that I like, but it's going to go with a lot of things. It's like a pretty neutral tan with almost like a green undertone. This is going to match so many spreads. It's such like a unique color that like, I feel myself reaching for so i'm excited about that and then we have i got two, apparently three sheets of the, do the scribblers another one of the spooky characters and then i did pick up peach party for no reason other than i thought it was cute do i have any idea when i'll use it nope not at all zero percent but i own it i don't really do a lot of birthday weeks for girls but maybe I'll choose it for a boy. Who cares? And then the week, this is <clears throat> one of the most ingenious things Andrea has done. Is she had custom art made for like a Christmas slash New Year's combo kit. This is literally what my stockings look like. Um, yeah, but so cute. Obsessed. Obsessed. And I got these and I got these because this tall girl is so cute. She's got like very square face and I just think she's stunning. Stunning, stunning, you know? And now we will get in to my big fat fantasy wax haul. Let's just, there's I think some random pins in here. Yeah, there it is. There it goes. There it goes. There's one more pin. I don't know where she is. She must be deeply buried in with the wax. Or I might have already taken it out of it, being honest with you. I think that's probably the case. Yeah, I definitely already took it out. Andre had doubles of these, so she gave me the other one. It's so cute. Oh, here it is. And she had doubles of this. It's a Lumiere airplane. Any hoodly doodle. Let's just talk about this, okay? Let me match up any doubles we have. We've got two of these paw prints. Two of these. Okay, so this was the Hocus Pocus collection, as well as I put, grabbed a couple of things she had left over from Overpour from a pre-order. We'll go over those first. I picked up this one, which is Zucchini Bread and Buttery Caramel. This was a scent that was in my first collab with them, called Simply Sweet. And it's still phenomenal, obsessed. And I grabbed two of French Bread Baguette and Brown Sugar, because I absolutely love this scent. 
delish, delish, delish. Okay, we'll go with like the two things I got two of. I got two of Please Don't Scream. I've also only seen Hocus Pocus one time and did not like it, so I do not really know many of these references. But this is Gourmet Sugar Cookie Pretzel in Malo Fluff. And it's in a super cute purple jack-o'-lantern. I love that I got an angry one and a happy one. That's just funny to me. Mm, I'm really getting the pretzel. You get the marshmallow and then you get that like sugary richness. It smells very like decadent. Glad I got two. And then I got two of Binks, which is peanut butter cookies, pretzel, and caramel. Those are like three of my favorite things in life. Oh yeah, glad I got two. Mmm, this is so yummy. I love it. These paw prints are so freaking cute as well. Um, I got one of these, Dance Until You Die. This was a brave one for me because I don't really like blueberry, but, like, I love pumpkin pecan waffles, and I was curious what they smell like together. This is so cute. This I've been loving all the different shapes she's been doing. This is so cute. This looks like this is where Spider-Man is laid to rest. The blueberry muffin is very strong. I will give it a try, and if I end up not loving the blueberry aspect, which is on me, it doesn't smell bad. It smells very strong. Um, then I'll just pass it along to somebody who loves blueberry. Then we have Burning Ring of Death. Cinnamon roll, cheesecake, and caramel coffee. This is my favorite one so far. Holy macaroni, I should have gotten more than one. Mmm. Y'all. I think I have cinnamon rolls in my fridge. I'm about to go make them after. Oh my God, smelling that. We got Sarah Vanilla Butter Fudge, Wild Berry Mousse, and Sugar Cookie. I love this lip shape. It's so good. If I'm ever lucky enough to do another collab with them, expect a lip shape. Mm, very yummy. The I don't love wild berry mousse, but it pairs so nicely with the vanilla butter fudge. So it actually makes a really good combo. This one is so good. I already smelled this one. It's called Black Lame Candle. It's apple cinnamon, mallow, fireside, and espresso. This smells like if you've ever melted Fire Mario or my Zuko scent. Fire Mario from Rose Girls or Zuko from my first Fantasy Wax collab. It smells like the fall version of this with the apple cinnamon, mallow, fireside, and espresso. It's so good. You smell all three of them pretty equally. And it literally just smells like you're sitting by a fire. There's people eating apples. It smells like you're at a fire in an apple orchard with cinnamon coffee. So good. We got book or book, 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 book. I'll call it book. I don't know. Flannel type and warm vanilla sugar. I thought this would be just like a nice cozy bathroom scent. And that's what it is. Flannel types almost like perfumey. So it's warm vanilla sugar. Smell kind of reminds me of my mom, if I'm being honest with you. It's kind of making me feel a little emo. Got this one, which is a Mucka Mucka Muck, Cafe Vienna, Pumpkin Pecan Waffles, and Pancakes. So good. I love Cafe Vienna. Mixed with that Pumpkin Pecan Waffle. Mmm. I don't particularly smell the pancake, but I'm sure it's just adding another layer of, like, bready sweetness. And then finally, we have Winifred, which is apple strudel, cornbread, and pretzel. Mmm, that's really good. The cornbread is really strong. You get that hint of apple. You know if I'm saying an apple scent is good, that must mean it's, like, really good. I don't actually like the apple scents. But, yeah. That is everything for this portion of the haul. Hello, guys, and welcome to the last portion of this haul. I think there's literally only one other clip, but here we are. This is the last clip for the October haul. The first thing I got is an order from Print Pression. I did order two sets of inserts for my two planners for next year, and then my everyday planner for next year, you guys. I had to have this one, it was just so good. And literally it just had to be mine. So this is gonna be my everyday planner for next year. You guys will not be seeing it because it'll be my off-camera planner. And then my filming planner will go from the hot pink one to the light pink one gonna keep with the theme of black for non-filming and pink for filming and yeah I'm just obsessed with the SPC edit print impression planners highly highly suggest but can you just look at this like lattice work it's stunning and basically I'm obsessed let me zoom out a little bit keep going Hannah there we go like it's just it's so freaking pretty I'm obsessed and then I just have one order here from Scribble Prints Co. I believe this is my only order. 
water over here? No, that's a fat lie. I found more. I found more. Okay, I've got like three orders from SBC. I'm like, I feel like I haven't filmed any haul clips. This is why I found it all. Okay. So we got this journaling card. It's very pretty. Zoom in a bit. I already have like multiple of these, but it's just so beautiful. As well as these Thanksgiving overlays in fall. Very, very, very cute. And then I have two kits in this order. The first one is Songbirds and Snakes. And this is actually gonna go right into my kit lineup. I am using this for my filming planner. Which, where does she go? With the Katniss bundle, and I'm using it in Gold Hollow and Taupe, and it's just gonna be wonderful. But this is for the new, um, Hunger Games movie, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. This is so pretty. Got my boy, freaking Tyrion. But yeah, I think Coral would also be really pretty, as well as Lavender Hollow with this one. And then I have the other scene that came with the kit, as well as I do have the Doodle Sampler. And then the next kit is potentially one of my favorite kits ever for Christmas time. And it is the Christmas baking kit. It's so funny because me and Andre are right now discussing what we're going to be doing for our cookie baking. We're going to have a whole cookie baking day and we each need to like figure out what recipes we want to do. There's so many good scenes in this kit. Like I literally don't know how I'm going to possibly pick. It's just really a wild time. It's such a good one. I'm obsessed. Just obsessed. Okay. And then I did get the tall box, the doodles, and then I did get Nemo and Remy. So those can go in my doodles bin for me to put away. Um, more kits that I picked up. I picked up this one which is the Arctic kit, which I do have a, I think this is the rest of the order. I don't know. I'm all over the place. We've got another one of these journaling cards. We've got this freebie, more of the Thanksgiving thingy, my bobbers. Next week order, can you fill up when you set up station? Okay. Um, These are the like super, like shiny hollow good like over full like to put over a full box overlays actually look really good with this and then i have this freebie so many freaking freebies but i have the doodle sampler that goes along with this kit so let us just take a peek we do have oh my god the little seal i can't with this kit so many cute animals Oh my god, the narwhal. I'm gonna literally pass away from how cute this is. I'm obsessed. This was something I requested that Andrea do, and I'm just so glad that it came to fruition. It's so cute. Oh my god, there's a penguin. Penguins are Chris's favorite, like, animal other than a dog. Dogs and penguins. Obsessed. So cute. And then we do, like, so cute. And then the doodles. That'll be good for January. And then this kit, I think I've used this kit two or three times literally at this point. And it is the frozen kit. If you want to order this, you'll need to email Andrea. Here's a little doodle sampler. But Lila's um, second birthday is coming up and it's going to be frozen themed. And Andrea's using this kit. And I was like, what's the chance I can get it? And she was like, I got you. So... That'll be for Miss Lila Joy's birthday. Any excuse to use frozen. Then I have this kit, which is the Snuggle Season kit. This one's super cute. We have the extra hands with like the Mary sign. I just love Christmas. Honestly, it's a fantastic time to be alive be cute with like the ugly sweater patterns or like even brick or birch it's great for a quote 
And then I did pick up the fashion people here and the fan boxes as well as the doodles because you need all the options when it comes to a Christmas kit, you know? And then finally, we do have the Home Alone kit, which obsessed, obviously. It's one of my top favorite Christmas movies. We've got the extra boxes here and then the full boxes. Got the wet bandits, we got the mom, we've got Kevin, we got the bird lady from the second movie. <sighs> Kevin again, the dad. It's just so cute. I just love Home Alone. I'm just, it's so cold today. It just feels like holly jolly. And Kevin with his grocery bag breaking, sweet little baby. And then we have the doodles. So that is everything for this month's haul, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not, then, well, give it a thumbs down. Either way, you're helping out my channel. Comment down below. Subscribe if you have not already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.